Let's yeah. talk about coronavirus. Okay. Okay. Coronavirus yeah. is an acute disease. Here we are talking about a chronic disease. Like, why should I sure. be bringing up an acute disease when we're talking about a chronic disease? And the answer mm -hmm. is because if you have chronic disease, you are much more likely to die from an acute disease. And in fact, mm -hmm. that's exactly what we see with coronavirus. Who is dying? Well, the elderly, yeah. And people with pre-existing medical Diabetes, metabolic yeah. health problems, diabetes, heart disease, kidney disease, et cetera. Those are the people who are having, you know, who are at greatest risk. Here's why. Turns out you don't die from the virus. You die mm -hmm. from the inflammatory response in your lungs called the cytokine mm -hmm. storm. Okay, in, uh, in medical terms, it's called adult respiratory distress syndrome. Okay, and that's not viral driven, that's your body's defense driven. Turns out people who already have chronic inflammation already have a high cytokine load. And so the virus then puts that into overdrive and that's what causes the problem. So eating real food will reduce that cytokine load and it will do it within two weeks. And even if you still are insulin resistant, you will be significantly better. I went to the store to stock up on provisions just like everybody else did. And what was missing from the store aside from toilet paper? Pasta, breakfast cereal, and candy. Mm. Now, you really think that's a good idea, people, to be stocking up on those three things? Because that's actually, that's your addiction system, you know, blaring loud, okay? Rather than, you know, taking it upon yourself to actually keep yourself healthy so that if you get coronavirus, you could actually survive it. So this is a big problem. I also have colleagues who uh, uh, have just published papers on the role of vitamin D and vitamin C in being able to mitigate some of the negative effects of coronavirus. Mm -hmm. Well, how much vitamin C and vitamin D do you think goes in processed food? <laughs> you gotta eat real food if you're gonna survive. 